Now that we've made our eight pointed rainbow star, we're gonna move on to a different fold. We're gonna be making the pinwheel star that, and I'll tell you how to make a checkerboard star as well. I have here eight sheets of paper, but you could, if you wanted, um, you could switch out your extras for four of the reds, and then you could alternate these colors. Um, you can mix and match amongst all the kite paper that you have. They're all the same size. But the one that I'm gonna do this time has the eight red pieces of kite paper. To begin, I'm gonna start with one piece of red kite paper, and I'm gonna fold it in half on the diagonal, just like we did with our eight-pointed star. I'm gonna open it back up and then bring this corner right to the center line. And I'm gonna do the same on the other side, and I'm gonna to try to line these points up in the center here. There we go. Now I'm gonna take this corner and bring it to the center line. And give it a nice, sharp crease. Now we're gonna do the same thing with the other side. Now I could stop here and do the same thing with the rest of the paper and then glue them together and that would give us a checkerboard star. But we're gonna do one extra fold here and make a pinwheel star. So if you wanna make a checkerboard star, stop here and do the same folds that I did here on the other eight pieces of paper. And if you wanna make a pinwheel star, we're gonna do this one extra fold where we're gonna take the right corner at the bottom here and bring it into the center. And we're gonna leave the other side unfolded. We're gonna create the same folds on the other seven pieces of paper. Now we have all eight points of our star ready. This is a slightly more complicated fold, so I do recommend gluing your flaps down. So we're gonna start with these top flaps here. Just open them up a little bit, glue on the inside, and then press them down. And then we're gonna do this bottom flap as well. And we're gonna do the same with the rest. It's time to assemble our star. You can see here, this is where it's gonna overlap. So you wanna make sure that the side here that's not folded, these are the, gonna be the bottom points of the star. And where the two sides are folded in, these are our top parts of the star. And this is where it's gonna overlap. So you can see that we're gonna put our glue right here where the stars are gonna overlap. A little glue here and then just like with the basic star I want my points to be touching and these this edge of the top star to be lined up along the center line of the bottom star and I repeat all the way around For the last point, I'm gonna add a little glue here to this part of the star, and then I'm gonna kinda of nestle it in again, making sure that this edge lines up with the center line of the bottom star and that the points line up. And now I flip this one back a little bit, add some glue, and voila. We have finished our pinwheel star. And you can really see the beautiful pattern when we hold it up to the light.